Yeah, could you not put that torch in my face? Do you mind? Have a bit of respect. Yeah, I know, but you just shine that right in my face, man. No, I'm doing exactly what you guys should be doing. I'm doing exactly what you guys should be doing. Minding my own business. Is a man not allowed to sit down? Why is that? Is it private property? Is it private property though? Yeah. Is it? Or is yeah. it funded by the taxpayer? What well, I do, seeing I'm a taxpayer, which would make this my bench, really, if we were splitting hairs. Excuse me, sir. Upload that video. You have no right to. You have no right to. I don't know, you tell me. I don't know, you tell me. I don't think Oh, really? Yeah, I would double check if I were you before you tried to breach my rights. Yeah. I don't know why you're troubling me. I'm just sat down. Because you're just out for attention, aren't you, again? I didn't say a word to you when you guys came out, did I? Did I say a word to you when you came out? You're just seeking attention because you've got nothing better to do. If you guys didn't say anything to me, there would have been no interaction and we would have all been good. And I would have just been sat here normally. I would have sat here, finished playing the game on my phone, and that would have been it. Do you reckon? Yeah. So you're not here taking pictures of police vehicles again? Not at all, check your CCTV. Check your members' staff's vehicles? Not at all, no, check, you the check your CCTV. You will, yeah. Yeah, or please do. Or check your YouTube channel later on. Yeah, please do. Yeah. It won't be on there later, it's probably going to be tomorrow. Yeah. yeah. Got some editing to do. I don't edit videos apart from taking out the little bits where there's no talking. Right. Yeah. And the bits that your name and address in. Well, yeah, because I don't want, because people don't like me. So why am I going to put my name and address online? I don't put your guys' names and addresses online. Have I though? Yeah. Really? Yeah. Can you show me on my channel where that is? Certainly could. Yeah, yeah, go on then. I it. believe it got removed after you had an issue with a previous officer. No, 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 no. no. That's yeah, not how it happened. Just getting a criminal behaviour order, didn't you? I chose to remove those videos. Following a criminal behaviour order? No, before I got the CBO actually. So, unlucky though, my CPN ran out today, so. Yeah. yeah. So I can actually finally put food on my table now. Since you guys took food out of my kids' mouths. Literally, yeah. Well, you stopped me from working, didn't you? What work do you do? Well, I'm a journalist. I'm registered for a media company. Yeah, you guys didn't care about it. It doesn't matter what media company. Fact is, I'm registered for a media company. No, I don't. They ran out today, 21st of September. Have I been disrespectful at all? How? How have I been disrespectful? No, I'm talking. No, no, excuse me. Like, with all due respect, Let's go based on like on what's happening in the right. present because listen, although I accept previously when I was on my YouTube channel that I could have a little bit of a potty mouth, I accept that. Mm. Never did I direct it towards anybody personally. Never did I threaten anybody or anything like that. However, how, sorry? Oh, Kevin? Yeah. How did I threaten Kevin? Well, so you threatened him, so you disrespected him. How though? And you directed things at him. How? What did I say to him? I, ha I didn't know his name until I made a complaint after I had the CBO. Did I? So how am I supposed to disrespect well, it? Talk about a complaint. You said, have I ever directly named people or something to that effect? But I did, how, did, how was I supposed to... Yeah. Well, if you watch the video, you will see that he refuses to say who he is. I, I mean, I don't know, you know? I mean, really and truly, what could have happened here is you could have come over and been like, Wesley, it's been a whole year now. You know, we had issues before. How about we move forward? A little bit of a better way. You know, I haven't been disrespectful at all this evening. Not so at all. First, first thing you said to us was we need to mind our own business. No, actually, you guys spoke to me first and I asked you, please, could you put your light down for it? It was in my yeah. face. That's the first thing yeah. I said. And, and then, then you said, said, what am I doing here? And I said, I'm just sat down. Can I not be here? I forget which one of you said, no, you can't because it's a police and station. Then said, and then I said, oh, but it's funded by, funded no, by the no, public, no, blah, blah, blah. No, I'm going to go on to say, and I said, yeah, I'm yeah. doing what you guys yeah. should be doing, yeah. which is that's minding, that's minding that's my own business. All right, okay, well that's so all. Not at all. If I want, if I wanted to, I'd have been stood up by the get by the door, like or like loads of other people, and, and as soon as you come out, I'd have been on your case. I just came to sit down. Other people on YouTube. I just came to sit down. I, came, I I went to get a coffee from Costa. It was closed, so I thought, you know what? Let me sit down here. I couldn't sleep, so I came out for a walk. I, I live around the corner. You guys know this. No, I don't. Okay, I, I, I okay, no, no. All right, no worries. But I live just around the corner. Yeah. You have camera. Yeah. Pointing it at the police station. Yeah. But that's the 
That's not just going for a coffee, is it? And we can write. No, no, no. Sorry, you're getting confused. I went for a coffee, yeah. but I couldn't get one. So then I've come here. It's two separate, no, separate okay. things. So you've come here. For yeah. Yeah, this is a police station. Should I not feel safe here? Like the thing is, you haven't even you asked me if I'm okay. You, you haven't even asked me if I've been okay. Like for all you know, yeah, somebody could have troubled me. On, hang on, that's the first thing he said. Oh, I didn't hear that, so my mistake okay. then. I apologise. I didn't he hear him. You, I didn't hear him say that. Me. Okay. No idea you are sat here. All right. There's, there's, it's not lit, is it, or anything like that? No, no, no. But I, I sat by the windows. I didn't sit in like the darker seat or anything like that. I don't, like, what is actually the problem? Just the fact that you don't want me sat here. Or am I doing something wrong? Well, I mean, obviously, you know what you do. You, you what do you? No, I know what I know what I do, but yeah. I, I also know what you guys think I do, which yeah. isn't the same yeah. thing. But that's what you think. But that's what. But that is what you think. Sorry, I've just said that like three times. Ask one of these two. I've just I have just explained to these guys. You can ask your colleagues. Yeah, had yeah. It expired on the 21st of September. I was issued it the 21st of September for six months. Yeah. We went to court on the 10th of February, yeah. where it was extended yeah. for another six months, which brings us to today, 21st of September. Am I right or am I wrong? Oh, I thought you just radioed through, that's all. And you used the word had, which is past tense as well, so I assume... All right, that's fine. I just, I just said, like, I literally just said. Have you... Oh, on, let, let me... Let me no, that's what you think, though. Yeah, do, I'll tell you what. I t do you know what? Do you want to know? Do you want? Yeah, All right. I'd respect you more if you were honest. Do you know? But this is the thing, though, right? This is the thing with the police, right? If I was to tell you the honest reason, you'd never believe it. Go for it. Have you ever? Have you ever asked yourself why people don't record ambulance and fire brigade? Like, this is a genuine question, right? Because I hear police say all the time, "Please don't film our cars or do this because people don't like us very much," right? That's exactly the reason why I came out and started, why I decided to be an auditor. Because I would like to bridge that gap between the people and the public. Because let's face it, not a lot of people like you guys. And no, because... And wait, can I, can I, could I... No, please, no, if I just let me finish, right? So there's not a lot of people out there... Um, no, sorry, that's not the right way to say it. A lot of people dislike the police for whatever reason, because of something one other police officer has done in the past or rare, rare, rare. It could be anything. You know what it's like. You're a policeman. You know what it's like, right? So I come out with my camera hoping upon hope that I can meet somebody who wears a uniform that can actually be respectful and honest and appreciate what I'm doing and say, actually, do you know what, Wesley? It is not up to me, sir, how the interaction goes. I treat everybody accordingly. If somebody comes up to me nicely, you've seen my videos, you mentioned them before. Have I acted this evening in any way as, as I have before? Well, I don't know. No, but you must, you do, you just don't want to answer. This is the Which problem. Means, well, I, way, I haven't sworn, I haven't oh, okay, sworn so once I here. I haven't been yeah, aggressive. I haven't, I haven't, no, but please, no, 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 no. No, but you don't have to understand. That is the thing. Like, I don't understand why you became a police officer. Or I don't understand why you put your hair in a bun. Or I don't understand why you do this, that, or the other. The fact is, no, I know, I know. But the fact is, I am a human being. I have free will. Okay, I'm allowed to go out and create content for my YouTube channel. I am allowed to do that. In fact, I am protected by law. I'm allowed to do it. So then why... I know, but when I know, no, please, no, sorry, please, 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 may I respond to this gentleman because what he just said is quite poignant, right? You said what you just said, right? Had you never have come out, you said I'm, I'm, you know, I'm allowed to do it. So why are you speaking to me? Because, right? Do you guys before when you said, oh, it's Wesley White? You had in your mind, yeah, the preconception you have of me of my videos, like this guy will shout, this guy will do this, this guy will do that. You want to know my preconception? Yeah, please. The only time no, I mean, when you realised it was me, I mean. Okay, well, before, and the only time I ever see people sitting there yeah. is when they're waiting to give a statement to Yeah. Someone. What so if... We're about to come over yeah. that, yeah. which officer you're waiting for. Yeah. But know? what if... If you need any help. What if I've just been out... No, I didn't. You don't want to talk to I didn't like it because the torch was in my face. Like, come on, you wouldn't like that. We if can't I... see you, can we? No, I, I appreciate and as soon that. As you said it, you put his torch on, didn't you? He did. Like, yeah, I know. I'm not saying you didn't. You're trying to twist my words. I'm not saying that you didn't. Like we're arguing over semantics here. Yeah. So I 
almost into a Starbucks yeah. if it has expired. Yeah, I understand that. I understand that. But this is the point, right? And this is this is where the issues, this is where things get es start escalating with police officers. Because I've noticed this a lot, right? Because I'm not a stupid guy and I'm quite articulate, right? And when we get to this point, you've said you know I'm not doing anything right. You've also said you knew it was Wesley White because when you came out of there, right? So between the four of you, yeah, okay, okay, semantics again. But between the four of you, you could come to a conclusion as actually, do you know what? We know from previous intel that this guy could be quite verbal, right? We know that. You guys know your inspector, O'Mahony, she knows why. I spoke to her about it. She knows the whole score. So you know, yeah? Your man here also knows that I'm not breaking the law. So oh, if, no, wait a minute. Well, please, I, I understand yeah. that, yeah. but please wait a minute, right? Now you know, you're still here talking to me, but if you know I'm not breaking the law and you know that I can potentially, no, wait a minute, but you know that I could potentially be verbally provocative, we'll say, why would you approach me? Because that, that to me just says you've come over to try to make me. I know, but, but then find, but then find out. Like, that's cool then. Yeah. Yeah. So we done our job, we? Can I ask you a question? Go for it. Right. How do you know that I just haven't had a problem out there and I've come here for safety? But I, but what if I'm too scared to tell you? But you were asked. Yeah, I know. But what if I'm too scared to tell you? What if I've just what if I've just come to sit here just to be safe? Yeah, but when we first said, are you all right? I said that I said that you should mind your own business. Which, in fairness, with that, like, sorry. If you were if you had just had an incident and you were scared. Yeah. But what if it, well, it's not really pointing to the, well, it kind of is actually, to be fair. All right, all right, it is, but that wasn't intentional, I just put it down. It's actually my head camera that's recording, by the way, not my if, camera. If there was anything that you wanted to report, there isn't at the moment. You first said, are yeah. you okay? Yeah. You would have said, no, I've just. Would I have, though? Does a victim of domestic abuse automatically tell them that tell you that they're a victim of domestic abuse? I've I've witnessed somebody ring the police and order a pizza because she was so, too scared to say I need the police. And as it comes back to the point I said to you earlier on, like there is a huge disconnect between the police and the people. Massive, yeah, massive. I don't believe for a second that you want that. And despite popular belief, I believe that we need the police force. Which is again why I come out with the camera because let's face it. The more people see police officers being kind and courteous and decent to members of the public who may well rub them the wrong way, what's that going to do? But is that your intention? I've just told you three times. Like you, time have you ever looked at my YouTube channel? Roughly. Have you ever looked at the about on what I, why I created my... Then please do because it says it on there okay. and it has not been edited. So I'll, I'll, I'll ask you a straight question. Please do. Roughly, how many dealings or how many times have you filmed a police officer having a conversation with you? Over a hundred. How many have you uploaded to your YouTube channel? All of them. Every single one. Every so single one. Ones on there as well. Every single interaction. Don't you, you look at. There's a police officer. There's. I can only take your word for yeah, it. Yeah, no, but you can have a look. There's a DWP. Uh, not. Uh, where is what's the one over Brislington? There's a DWP centre by the DVSA. You know the place where they test you for your like disability. Um, no, something like that. No, I, I, well, I interacted with a police officer up there well, who upheld my rights. I, he, he looked a bit like, um, I don't know if you know wrestling, but he looked a bit like Triple H. We had a bit of a joke that he looked like Triple H. Yeah. That's on there. That is on there with me saying to him, excuse me, sir, thank you, because yeah. if a police officer wrongs me, I will tell them off. So it's only right for me to say thank you to a police officer who's... Who, ask Sarah O'Mahony about... I've never been rude to her because she's always honest with me. Even if she knows I'm not going to like what she says, she still tells me the truth. She yeah. still, she's courteous. She appreciates that. Do you know what, Wesley? You're a, she's respectful, honest, appreciative of who I am as a person, as well as her being an inspector. So I would never cuss her out because why would I? She is one of the police officers that I wish to see every single day. I know you guys think I'm, but you, I know, no, it's cool, but I know you guys think I want the negative interaction, but if you actually watched my videos and listen, on yeah. every, pretty much every single one of my videos at the start, you can hear me say, guys, let's hope we get a good interaction today. Because I'm about social interactions. I love people. I get, I, I love people. Well, it's up to you. We'll start again well, no, well, there's plenty of time to redeem yourself. I mean, come on, man. Like, redeem ourselves from what? Well, come on, man. You. Oh, have I done wrong today? Let's, let's be honest. All right, all right. Let's be honest, yeah. yeah. But although, when I say this, I, I'll appreciate that I don't, no disrespect, but I don't believe you guys will be 
honest and agree with it. But when you came over here and you said to me, and you got anything better to do, yeah. I'm at work when I'm out with my camera. So if I come up to you when you're at work and I say, oh, you're a copper and you got anything better to do, like, it's not good for you as a police officer who took an oath to protect and, and, and be and have integrity and honesty, yeah. yeah? It's not good for you to mock what I'm doing because that's disrespectful. Well, I didn't know you had money from it. So. But it makes no difference if it's a hobby of mine. If I'm fishing, you wouldn't walk past a fisherman and be like, fuck, mate, what are you fishing? You, you, and you've got nothing better to do with your time. It's rude. Fish is quite boring. It doesn't matter. Have you ever woken up with a river, dude? No. Then you, don't, you can't say fishing is boring then no. because you've never done it. But do you understand what I'm saying? Yeah. It's like, if you're going to be like, oh, with this, that, you know, because you're police, you're in, you're, you're in a position of authority and you just expect me just to cower when you say, oh, you got anything better to do. Oh, it's just... A, no, but it, you, you, you know what I mean, though, do you not? I mean, also as well, look at this. There's four of you all stood around me. You could have all stood together so I could see you in one view, but I can't see you all when I'm looking... If I'm looking at you, I can only see you and her. Do you know what I mean? Yeah. So you have to understand how that makes me feel when I haven't done anything wrong as well this is also another disrespectful thing all we want as as people and you can read the comments on, i know you won't but read them, all we want is for police to be honest to act with integrity do you know what i mean we, then we wouldn't have things like sarah everard or I'm, i can't even say his name because the case hasn't even gone to court yet but you will know about the police officer in birmingham yeah. Horrendous thing. Yeah, I know. But people, what people in every walk of life do horrendous I, things. I I appreciate yeah, of course. Shipman is an absolutely horrendous person. Of course. I wouldn't go up and just start filming every doctor no. assuming that they're all involved in No, of course not. You know I mean? Of course not. But if a doctor does something wrong, another doctor would say, Yeah, that's wrong, he shouldn't have done that. Yeah. Whereas if a police officer does something wrong, another police officer won't say, Oi mate, you shouldn't do that or go and tell a superior. Do you know what I mean? Surprised. No, but let, no, but all right, all right, all right. Take me personally, for example, then, right? How many other auditors of people that go out and record police have you seen on YouTube? I don't know, I know they Loads though, right? I've seen auditors sit outside a police station with a blanket covered in pork products, having a picnic, right? Nothing happened. They go to police stations wearing pig masks, literally pig snouts, mm. nothing happens. I say fuck off once or twice. So I never have understood what the difference is anyway, right? But the fact is, I haven't done anything wrong. I never did anything wrong a year ago, but still I had, um, I had restrictions imposed on me. One, yeah, yeah for, fit, for doing something that I, is protected under Article 8 of the Human Rights Act. I've had detective inspectors delete images from my phone, arrest me, keep me for nine hours to then not turn up at court after he tries to use legislation which is input to protect victims of domestic violence, right. I have been violated. Violated. Got complaints in about that? Of course I have, but when you complain no, to the police, complete. what happens? Complain to the police complain. about the police. And this is what you I say. Complain to the IPCC. Yeah, but who, who runs them? The police. They're not independent though, are they? Like, like a, do you, like, I don't, I don't want to disrespect you, right, by asking this question, but, but right, you must know, you must, you're a police officer, so you know the law to a certain extent, right? So answer me this question. Is it lawful for a police constable, detective, inspector, or any member of the police force to delete images from a person's mobile phone or camera without a court order? So. It's not. It's, it's quite, totally quite illegal. It's totally. Yeah. It's not a niche law. It's there, clear as day in legislation. It's so illegal. When I say niche law, I mean that's something we don't deal with every okay. day. Okay, you know I appreciate it, but which is why. Right. we deal with, we go out and deal with yeah. assaults, domestic violence, thefts, and things like that. Do you know what I mean? We, yeah. we deal with it quite frequently. I got to jump in on this conversation because I like that. I tell you something funny, right? When I first got my camera, yeah, not this one, my actual camera, I was taking a picture of the moon, and as I snapped a picture, the space station flew right across the front of it. It's a oh, wicked cool. picture. Right? I don't dance so much longer, but I'll be honest with you. Yeah, that's cool. Um, just until I finish playing my game, which is what I was doing. I just wanted to have a sit down. A game on my phone. Yeah, I had my phone out when you guys came over. So you checked my CPN, yeah? Yes, check Okay. Yeah, because my CP. Like, have you seen me here once during my CPN? Do you think. Do I come across as a stupid guy that I would be here if I had a CPN? You were hanging out your balcony. Oh, was that you? Let me ask you a question then. Why did you shout my address out? I shouted your name out. And my address. 
I got you on record, bro. That was on YouTube. Yeah. yeah. And you, yeah, no, it's not. I didn't put it on my YouTube channel. You shouted my address out. Why am I gonna put my address on my YouTube channel? Why am I gonna, bro? You're sh you're knocking on my door, talking to me about my kids and my ex-girlfriend. No, but no, 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 no. You're saying why don't I put it on my YouTube channel? You're talking about my. You were, when you came to my house, you're talking about my kids and my ex-girlfriend. Yeah. Why do I? Why am I going to put that on my YouTube channel? Yeah, but you. Yeah, but have you got kids? No. So you wouldn't understand then. Any? Have you got kids? Yeah, but I would still understand. No. No, no, no. But here's the thing. No, no, no. But here's the thing. Here's the thing, though, right? Here's the thing, yeah? If a man goes to see his children, right? Because the woman won't let him, yeah. and he just goes there anyway, yeah. that's not harassment. Turning up on an house could, could be classed as harassment. Could be. I'm going to look for my kids. It's yeah. not harassment. I'm going to look for my children. It's not harassment. So you shouldn't have been outside shouting harassment to my neighbours, talking about this, that, and the other, and then you walked off down the road and shouted my name. But here's another thing as well. Here's another thing like what you said earlier. There's another, he just reminded me of something. When I requested your body cam... Yeah, because it's pointless. <laughs> it is though, because... Yeah, but you should... Listen, why did you shout when you went... No, no, no. Yeah, we could have. 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 But... I, because I didn't want to speak to you. But you, but you chose to engage in conversation. No, I actually... Shut, no, hold on a minute. Hold on a minute. Hold on a minute. Can I bring the body... Hold on a minute. Can I... I'm answering your question. Yeah, I did. Because I did do that. I shut the door and then you rang the buzzer again. Yeah, and you could ignore it. But you chose to engage in But you rang my buzzer again. Yeah, but you rang my buzzer again. Ignore it. Ignore it. But that's harassment, isn't it, then? But it's unwanted contact. You came to my house unwantedly, you rang my buzzer, I said to you, I, I came, wait a minute, yeah, yeah, I know, but you rang my buzzer, you rang my buzzer, I came out the door, I came out the door, I looked out, I spoke to you, I told you to go away, and then I shut the door, then you rang my buzzer again. But I didn't break a law, so I don't need directives. This, I feel like this is going a bit downhill because you're affronted by me not liking you shouting out my address. All right, no, 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 I never said I didn't like you, I, I said... I didn't like that you shouted out my address. You literally said you didn't like it. No, I, no, 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 I didn't, I didn't. Anyway, you said you were reminded of something? Like um, yeah, you were talking about complaining, but when he, he shouted out my address from like 50 yards away, and when I, requested the, um, when I requested his body cam, the people who sent the body cam cut it off before he said my address, even though I've got it recorded where he says my address. Well, maybe he just turned his body cam off. No, he didn't, though. That's the thing, he didn't. But do you know what I mean? He's like... This is why I get so frustrated because, you know, it's one rule for another and another one for no. Like, you guys are all on me when you think I'm breaking the law. But how many times have you spoken to one of your colleagues about breaking the law? Do you know what I mean? To prevent a breach of the peace, right? But he cannot threaten to arrest me for an offence that is not going to occur. It's not going to what? It's not going to happen. Like... There is, there is going to be no breach of the peace. So for yeah. him, it's like you saying to me, Wesley, I'm going to arrest you if you go and kill somebody. Like, obviously. You prevent the breach of the peace. Yeah. The only way that it ends up going to court or anything like that is with a bind over the breach of the peace. It then becomes an offence. Well, it's silly anyway. Did he, has he checked my CPN? Or did, did he just walk off? Did he just not care? He didn't care. Was, is that his usual partner? They're usually together. I was just trying to work out if he was the old guy that came with this gentleman I'm to my house sure. that time. Um, we chained every now and then, except during COVID, where we sort of had rain. Where you had to stay. Yeah. yeah we to that was mad, isn't it, COVID? Here's the thing yeah. why I didn't get it. Like, surely you would have thought, you know, COVID would make people start doing different stuff. I mean, everybody's in their house, watching TV, internet. Oh, what's going to happen? New trends are going to arise, especially something that's huge over in America. First Amendment what's audits. That? First Amendment audits. You know, you have oh, the experience. Auditors, right. exactly. You know, England always follows America in trends. Mm. Do you know what I mean? It just, you know, it's like I mean, we could go on about it forever. But it, it, the, the, what the crux is, uh, and I leave it at this because I've been aw I've been away from filming for a long time. But yeah. in all honesty and in all respect, the police have the wrong idea on what this is supposed to be. Now, I respect the fact that there are a lot of people that go around doing filming the police that. I said, there's, I know, I appreciate there are a lot of people that probably go around filming the police that don't act with decorum and probably are purposely rude and, and go to places I specifically hunting out. Mate, I, you Maybe. watch my YouTube channel. And this, I've always said it to no, Sarah. You said. No, I've not really no I know. Person, but I said, said it to Sarah. To yeah, I did. I did used to swear. I have anxiety. No, I didn't ever say that. I have anxiety. 
you know what I mean? Yeah. So when people approach me, I, I can get loud. I can even carry a medical card, okay. do you know what I mean? So it's like, it's not just a case of me just, just trying to be, you know, just sometimes when I speak, I can get loud, do you know what I mean? Yeah. Like, which is why I raised the point earlier, like I haven't, I haven't been rude or anything. I know that you don't like me here, but I haven't done anything wrong. I like you here. I'd like me to find out why you were here. Yeah, but I'm a, I don't have to have a reason though, do I? No, but that's, that's all I'm doing. <laughs> yeah, no. Every, every other time, my six years working this station, yeah. I've walked up to someone standing here saying, yeah. why are you here, yeah. or what do you need, or whatever. Every time I've just said anything to anyone there, yeah. like, I want to speak to such and such, or mm. I'm here to report such and such. Yeah. So if I was just to walk past you, completely ignoring you, mm. then that wouldn't be fair on yourself, really, because it'd be like... Well, well that's what I want, Ed. That, because I'm like, well... Who's this? You know, what do they need? What do they want? Yeah. Okay. And then once we establish who we, you are, we need to establish if you're committing offences. Yeah. Because. But here's the thing: if I'm going to come to a police today, station, say to you, you would have been committing such offences. Yeah, I know. Which is why I haven't been here. So that's exactly why this interaction's kind of bad, isn't it? So you must understand that. I, I, I understand what you think the scenario is. The, totally, I do. Which is why I said to you, I feel like the police have got the wrong idea on what auditing is. I really do. I believe that you guys believe that auditors come out specifically to cause a problem or to cause an interaction. Ones, well. Some do. I agree, yeah. I agree with you, which I call them frauditors. Right. I agree with you. Some yeah. of them do do that. But yeah. that doesn't mean to say that all of them do. But the, the kind of like the generic way for police have been told to deal with auditors is to treat them as if they're hostile. We're not told to do anything. Well, then why did you then? Why did I? Well, you know, I've told you exactly why I came up to you. All right, fair. Because yeah. I have no, I had no idea who you were initially. Yeah, you, you, you're you're a pretty decent guy anyway. Like I don't have any. I know who you are. Yeah. Then I need to find out if you are committing those offences. I recognise this constable though. Have we spoken before? No, I've never met you before. Am I free to go? Well, yeah, I'll just do a couple to tell you. Yeah, so I'm free to go. CPN's over. Yeah. The exact date it went off. Twenty first today. But yeah, all we know is it's expired. So. Yeah, yeah. Cool. Cool. Amazing. Pleasure. We'll see you soon, maybe. Yeah, possibly. Yeah. Well. Oh, what was your number, by the way? Yeah. Four nine. And you, miss? <laughs> miss? What's your number there, please? 2562. Thank you. Well, guys, that was interesting. I had to let them know. I had to. Anyway, peace.